we missed Jack big time. But uh, on to Leeds on next week. I think we'll get three points there. Uh, I thought the game, end to end game. Defensively, we're poor. Stoke and Hurst had a lot of pressure on us. So, we to take a point at home with Stoke. It's probably one of the best teams we're going to take. I think yeah. hot and a left back. He just he doesn't feel comfy. We're missing Taylor that game. And Greenish. Greenish in the middle. Whelan doesn't feel Greenish's place. He should have brought her hair on. Yeah, I will sign over there. Her hair yeah. I, think, I think he's a good fit for Greenish's role. Whelan's an end man at the end of the day. Yeah. 17th, 18th minute, like he did at really Middlesbrough. Oh, I think we were lacking. I think we had times we were looking for Jack and the eight ball wasn't there. Jack knew all the kicks and midfield to the strikers and it just wasn't there today. But um, Stoke are a good side, so it might not be a bad resource at the end of the season. Well, it shows in January we need a centre half. We need somebody that will we'll grab one of our players by the grab the throat and say, look, come on. Yeah, yeah, hopefully it's coming to the new year. We can bring in some recruitment up for the new owners, which is going to be a life into our club. To be honest, I thought once they got the. When they, after they got in front again, I thought that was it all over then. But, you know, we dug in, we've got an equaliser. Like I said, I think you'll find out what the good results at the end of the season. Well, we played well, but again, we were second half, and I think a draw was lucky for us at the end of the day. Stoke made us off the pitch. Yeah. Could have been, it could have been a lot worse, it could have been easy. Yeah, lucky we got the penalty. Well, Codger done well. Yeah, Codger come on and ain't had to do fair, he did change the game. And getting a goal, breaking with their boost confidence. But then what's Al Mohammed doing at the end? He just let him run in the box and he fouled him. Yeah. Yeah. Just turned him over, an easy turned him over. Yeah, they're a very good side. I mean, they've just come to the Premier League. They've, they've kept a lot of Premier League players uh, and they're playing good football. I mean, if you look, they, they put a lot of pressure on us, especially in the second half. So, yeah, I'll take a point from there. But, uh, Obviously, you won't three points, but unfortunately, it wasn't our day. Confident for the rest of the season? Yeah, I thought when I made a prediction, I thought we'd win the league after the uh, after after the Albion game. So stick with it, guys. I think we're, we're on the right road here. Yeah, I think yeah. If, if, if Grealish is back next week, we all hope he is. I think uh, I think he's got to do something against Leeds. Uh, I think we're lucky against Stoke. Leeds has got to be. Yeah, we've got to win Leeds. Yeah, if we, if we want to push for playoffs or even the top. We need to be Leeds. I mean, yeah, but it all depends on January. Hopefully, we can get some funds. Um, we can get that centre half, possibly maybe a new goalkeeper. Um, it's still not 100% sure. Still makes that, that mistake and again. Um, it all depends on the January, really, after the new year. Christmas is normally a time. We've only just got a new manager. Uh, Dean Smith do fantastic. So, we go from there, but definitely not a bit of performance, but we've got to take a point for Stoke at home, definitely. Um, and we go on to, to the next section.